I lived like three and a half hours from Calgary growing up, so we'd go once in a while to the Calgary Stampede, and it was this huge event. And I remember when I was young, I'd go up to the Nashville North Tent where all the big stars would go, and I remember just dreaming that someday I could get on that stage. And so the Stampede was the first, the first time I ever got to play that stage. It was a, it was a huge event for me, and it, it kind of signified uh, finally making it. Oh, must do things. Um, just eat lots of bad food. There's there's amazing midway food. Uh, of course, at all fairs, but this being one of the world's greatest fairs, has just amazing food. So, uh, if you're if you're on a diet or going on a diet, wait till you come home from the stampede. The true cowboys that that are on the range, and and stay with the cattle while they graze and stuff is this so rare. I think a part of part of the country country singing and stuff is to keep that. Um, that legend and that story alive, and and every once in a while I do write a song about cowboys, and and that's the th cool thing about the Stampede is you're guaranteed to see real cowboys, not just the the ones that you know wear big belt buckles and stuff, and and not just country singers. You will see the real deal when you're at the Calgary Stampede.